All right. Anybody got a question? Off top. Off top. Yes. I do. I will. I will sign it as soon as it gets to my desk, which should be soon. It has to go through uh, ratification. Any more questions? Yes, sir. I can't hear you. Say it again. I want to. I want to see exactly what all those bills and uh, how that ends up. Uh, we uh, have a very good absentee program now, uh, including the witness verification, and I will, I will certainly uh, insist that we, we keep that. But once they get through, I'll evaluate it. No, absentee voting is part of our law. You just have to follow the rules. And one of those is requiring an absent, uh, a witness uh, signature. It, it, by mail means a lot of different things to different people. I, I'm in favor of the absentee program the way we have it now, because it works. I, I have the positives and negatives about that. I understand the, the, the idea behind it and the reason for it, but there are also uh, other questions that need to be answered about the, the First Amendment. Uh, Thomas Jefferson wants to describe the First Amendment freedom of religion in the U.S. Constitution as the freedom of thought. And the hate crimes legislation around the country, uh, some believe, infringes on that. Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't, but th those are the kind of things that I would want to see the, the final product. It, it depends on what's in it. Can't, can't guess as to what might be in it until it, it, till it gets there. Do I think they should add that back? Yeah. Uh, of course, that'd be up to them, but I, I, I see no reason to add that back, but that's up to them. Again, it's, it's the final version that counts. Governor, a lot of eyes were on the uh, courtroom in the, uh, Minnesota last night on the uh, Shaman trial. Any thoughts on, on the verdict and, and views that kind of came out of there last night? Well, the, the whole episode, of course, uh, the, the death is a George Floyd is, is a tragedy. The, the whole thing is a, a tragedy. But the, the system there in Minneapolis worked. Uh, there's been a, a jury trial, there's been a verdict. There may be other steps, but the whole thing is a tragedy. I think we have the best law enforcement establishment in the world uh, in South Carolina. We are just uh, a, a few hundred yards away from a, an excellent criminal justice academy, a statewide academy. They don't have those in most places. I'm 100% in, in favor of supporting our law enforcement. I want to have them in the schools to protect the children and the staff and the teachers. But uh, they need to be, have the very best training, the very best equipment. But I'm proud of our law enforcement in South Carolina. I'd also like to see that they and our military, career military retirees uh, have no uh, income taxes on their retirement pay. I think we have to have a strong, solid, highly trained and highly skilled law enforcement in South Carolina. And I, I, again, I think our law enforcement here is, is, is good or better than any in the country. Well, it, there's always anticipation and anxieties on, on uh, tragic uh, events and cases like that, highly publicized, highly emotional. Uh, I think most people are, uh, are comforted by the fact that the, the, the system worked. We, we have the, 
you've heard a thousand times the best judicial system in, in the in the world with in, in the United States under our Constitution but it, it is good to to have a system that works and I know a lot of people are are gratified to see it work but again it's a tragedy there, there are no winners uh, in such a situation as that okay bye